Yo, so how's it going guys? Welcome back to another GTA 5 video. So about two weeks ago, I did show you guys an awesome trick that allow you guys to get this naked hot knife card that you can see on screen. And a ton of you guys going off the feedback or really seem to enjoy that video. You can see why, because it is a good thing to do when you get on GTA 5, show off some of your cars to your friends. And it's always good to have like a rare car or a card that they may have never seen before, just completely forgotten about. So I thought I'd go ahead and show you guys how you can get this rare modded looking naked Panto. And if you guys aren't aware, you can only purchase this is car with full bodywork however as you guys can see on screen i've managed to rip off the roof it's got no boot it's got no side skirts it's got no front bodywork it's got no back bodywork and no doors so it's completely naked and just looks really awesome in my personal opinion i do remember some modders having these back in the day and everyone wanted them on 360 and ps3 however today i'm going to be showing you how you could all get this car without any mods for free working on all consoles so as always if you guys do go on to enjoy the video and you want to see me post more videos like this in the future do be sure to drop a like down below feel free to subscribe if you're new without further ado let's get into the video okay so like i mentioned in the intro this does work on every single console so all of you guys will be able to do this straight away it's very easy and very straightforward all you guys want to do is i'm doing on screen call up your panto if you guys don't own a panto i believe you can buy one off southern san andreas website for only about 80k so it's really cheap for the rare modded vehicle that you're going to be getting out of this now once you guys have got your panto you simply just want to bring it over to any ls customs in the game okay so as soon as you guys arrive at ls customs the very first thing you want to do is go down to bodywork and you want to select the carbon fenders now once you guys have selected the carbon fenders as i'm doing on screen you simply want to scroll between stock and the sticker bomb fenders so between the top option and the bottom option just flick in between them as you can see me doing on screen and you guys should notice when you're flicking through them very quickly as soon as you guys land on stock it should be invisible now once that turns invisible simply just select stock so now you have an invisible bodywork from here you want to then go down to front bumper and this is the easiest part of the whole glitch as soon as you guys select front bumper all you have to do is simply select the extreme aero front bumper as you can see me doing on screen and then once you've bought that just simply go back and apply the stock and you, as you guys can see as soon as you select stock the whole front bumper is now invisible very easy very straightforward now once you guys have done that you want to go down to rare bumpers you want to select the carbon rare bumper and then you just simply want to flick in between stock and carbon as quick as you can until stock becomes invisible then once stock is invisible simply just purchase it now moving into the final part we'll basically make the roof invisible which will also make the boot or the trunk if you guys are american invisible so this is a two in one all you want to do is go down to roofs you want to apply the carbon roof and tailgate as soon as you've applied that to your car simply go straight back up to stock and then scroll in between stock and the sticker bomb and tailgate now i'm not going to lie to you guys this may take a little while getting used to but you will get the hang of it and eventually it will work it didn't work for me straight away but after a few ago of getting used to it as you guys can clearly see it turns invisible once you guys land back on stock then you just simply want to select it so don't give up straight away a bit of persistence will pay off in the end however from here you're basically done you just want to fully kit out the car how you like it and this is the great thing about the panto because it comes with some crazy customization features you can make this car look really sick and modded it comes with big old exhaust sticking out the back as you guys can see you have some really unique looking grills as well as a bunch of stuff that you can put on the roof so even if you and a couple of your friends do this naked panto glitch you can still make your cars look very different from one another to make your car look even more rare and extra special but before i do so i just want to quickly prove to you guys that once you've applied all this invisible bodywork to your car and you take it into your garage it will remain like this forever and if you guys ever want to get it back to normal all you have to do is take it back into ls customs and apply some bodywork back to it and you'll be able to see it again however as you guys can clearly see when i'm in my garage i've still got the roof missing so it's like a convertible panto which is extremely rare no boot no bodywork around the entirety of the car this version right here i actually decided to put a grill on it if you guys actually want to make it look more naked i would suggest maybe removing all grills from it because it makes it look more naked but like i said if you guys want to make it look just like a crazy modded little beast then mess around with the grills the engine and all that shit now as i mentioned earlier i like to apply something extra special to this car to give it a little unique touch now when i was actually customizing this car in ls customs it just reminded me of something that i remember seeing a long long time ago i'm pretty sure most of you guys have heard of the celebrities p diddy and jay-z i remember watching some sort of program where they were stripping down a jeep car and they ended up making it look really sick by just ripping off the doors so they was literally driving around miami with their feet dangling out the car and this gave me a quick idea because i've practically ripped off the boot the trunk the skirts the bodywork the roof to make this car look extra unique what i would suggest doing 
before you go to meet up with your friends or go to any car meet, pull up your interaction menu, open the doors as you can see me doing on screen, and then simply just drive into a wall and then you can clip off the doors and then this car all of a sudden looks like a complete different beast, 100% naked and I think it looks very sick but most importantly extremely unique. So there we go guys, a brand new glitch and how you guys can acquire this modded naked panto. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video, if you're still watching to this point and you probably have, all I ask is you return the favour by dropping a like down below. Feel free to subscribe if you're new as I do post all the latest and greatest GTA 5 content. I've been your host Laser Gaming. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you in my next video.